Good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Idris Balogun. I'm a student of the University of Alfosche, United Kingdom. Uh, I'm here to present to you uh, the last phase of my project for the award of um, master's, a master's degree on um, Zizutek Nigeria Limited, a Nigerian-based company uh, specializing in the sales and repair of industrial sewing machines. Um, in the fiscal year, the company achieved a remarkable 10 million naira in revenue, reflecting a notable 5% increase compared to the preceding year. Additionally, the net profit exhibited a, a commendable 2% rise, amounting to 2 million naira, with an impressive uh, profit margin of 20%. Zintech Nigeria Limited boasts a diverse customer base, consisting of fashion design companies, industrial manufacturers, and grassroots empowerment programs. Um, the primary contributors to the company's revenue includes um, fashion design companies at uh, at fifty percent, industrial manufacturers at thirty percent, and um, grassroots empowerment program at twenty percent. Um, despite maintaining uh, a ten percent market share, it is essential to know that um, um, competition in Nigeria industrial sewing um, industrial sewing machine market remains highly intense, with notable competitors like um, like Ohe Nigeria Limited, um, affordable sewing machines. Um, um, sewing tooth kills and um, Ayobola, um, and Ayobola, yeah, uh, and Ayobola sewing machines. Yes, uh, the next um three slides. Yes, the next three slides um dives into um the critical phase of testing and evaluating proposed solution and model at Zizitech Nigeria Limited. Um, this phase uh, plays a pivotal role in ensuring that our initiatives align with, uh, with objectives and exhibit real world feasibility. In the landscape market by, in the landscape uh, marked by, by market challenges and technological shift, um, rigorous testing bridges the gap between theory and practice, fostering efficiency and enabling um, evidence-based decision-making. This introduction um, serves as a testament to Zizutech Nigeria Limited on wavering um, com commitment to, to, to proactive improvement through comprehensive evaluation, a fundamental step towards achieving, achieving success. Now let's let's employ the, the methods and um, the methods for solution and, and model testing. Well, we have our quantitative testing. Uh, quantitative testing involves uh, the meticulous measure of uh, specific metrics and numerical data. For Zintech Nigeria Limited, this is encompasses the analysis of efficiency ratio, error rates, um, production output, and cost savings. The, by quantifying these factors, the company can um, can objectively evaluate the impact of uh, of the solution and model on its operation operation performance. Um, to illustrate this, measuring the reduction in the time taken to complete certain tasks following the implementation of certain uh, of modern sewing machine provides a uh, a clear quantitative assessment of um, of increased efficiency. Yeah, let's look at quantitative testing as well. Uh, quantitative testing shifts our focus towards gathering insights and, pers and perspectives from stakeholders through survey, interview, and feedback sessions. This is Tech Nigeria Limited can um, can gain a profound understanding of the subjective experiences of of employees, managers, and uh, and customers. This um, this approach uncovers um, nuances that quantif that quantitative metrics might overlook. For instance, it can um, it can review whether employees find the new technology user friendly, how it um, how it affects their daily task, how it affects their daily task, and whether customers perceive an improvement in 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 product quality. Um, also, let's look at a uh, comp um, comparative testing. Comparative testing entails a direct comparison of the performance of existing processes. Or, or um technologies with the proposed solution or model. This can be achieved through A B testing. Yeah. Um, or yeah, or or controlled experiment. This technology limited could um, for instance, implement modern sewing machines in one section of their production line while retaining the old machines in another. By analyzing the performance of both sections, uh, the company can quantify the advantages brought about by the new technology. By the new technology. Um Let's do, let's look at uh, user user testing. Let's look at user testing. Um, user testing involves direct engagement with end users, 
such as employees, you're printing the machine and customers using the product. By observing how, how users interact with the new technology and gathering their feedback, the company can, um, can identify potential usability issues, pain points, and areas for improvement. This is that testing is, is invaluable in, in refining the solution or model to, to better align with, 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 uh, with new users and, uh, and preferences. Yeah, so let's look at the, the next two slides. Next two slides um, strive into enhanced efficiency and productivity as individual limited are uh, joining to characterized by a dynamic process of continuous adjustment and um, adaptation. Allow me to emphasize the significance of making deliberate adjustments and amendments to our proposed solutions and model. Um, one, we have a um, continuous, um, continuous improvement. The foundation of our success lies in embracing a philosophy of continuous improvement. Uh, Yes, rather than settling for initial implementations, isn't it Nigeria Limited technologies the need to consistently refine our strategies? This approach cultivates a culture of growth and um, innovation where we attractively refine our practices to align with evolving needs and um, industrial, industrial trends. Yeah, um, iterative approach. Yeah, yeah, iterative approach. Um, adopting an iterative approach ensures that we do not treat solutions as static entities. Instead, we um, we continually assess the effectiveness of our strategies, collect real-time feedback, and uh, incorporate necessary modifications. This uh, iterative cycle enables us to pivot swiftly, enhancing outcome based on new insights and, and changing circumstances. Uh, we also have feedback in incorporation. Um, valuing feedback from employees, stakeholders, and clients is, uh, is pivotal. Yeah, by actively seeking input and insight, this the Nigeria Limited can, um, can identify areas um, requiring adjustments. This um, input-driven approach is in pinpointing pain points and um, highlights potential enhancements that might have been initially overlooked. Yes. Um, yeah, going into um, data visualization and communication of insight. Yeah, the next two slides um, hold substantial value for Zinzita Nigeria Limited as we navigate the complexity of our business landscape. Um, by transforming intricate data into accessible visual formats, we can effectively communicate with um, in, communicate vital insight to our, to our diverse stakeholders. In our context, data visualization serves as a bridge between technical analysis and, and strategic decision making. Yes. Um, um, careful selection of visualization method is, is very paramount in this, in this case. We can employ bar charts to um, to compare sales performance over different uh, time periods, or use pie chart to illustrate the comparison composition of our of our customer base. Um, the tailored approach ensures that insights are only not 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 only clear but also aligned with our cost our company's um, objectives. Effective data visualization extends um, beyond uh, presentation. Um, it influences actions and decisions. Yeah, by by creating impactful impactful visuals, Digital Nigeria Limited can. Um, can, can inspire confidence in these strategies. For instance, a, a visually compelling depiction of the potential growth in market share through the adoption of modern technology could, um, could actually encourage stakeholders to support their initiative. Yeah. Uh, yes, uh, let's look at, um, yes. Uh, yeah, the next two slides um, talks about the interpre interpreting the data gathered during the analysis phase in a, is, a, is a pivotal step in our project. This um, slide delves into how the data interpretation process compares to the initial data analysis hypothesis. Yes, uh, we have the data data analysis uh, hypothesis. We um, we formulated assumptions based on available data and industry knowledge. Now, the interpretation stage scrutinizes the, um, the analysis outcome against this hypothesis. We, we assess whether our, our expectations align with the reality portrayed by the data. This this process uncovers um, discrepancies, com confirming or refuting our initial assumptions. Yeah, uh, we have application of findings. Um, once the interpretation is complete, the, the findings are, are applied to the company's strategies. If the analysis supports our hypothesis, we validate our strategies and um, consider fine-tuning them for optimal outcomes. On the other hand, um, if the data contradicts our assumptions, we, we adapt our strategies accordingly. This might involve exploring new avenues adjusting goals or or um or implementing more efficient practices in essence this 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 stage bridges the gap between raw data and um, actionable insights uh, it enables this Nigeria limited to ensure 
their decisions are grounded in empirical evidence, reducing the risk associated with assumptions. Um, by closely scrutinizing data, we um, we can fine tune we can fine tune the company's approach, leading to more informed and effective decision making. This um, this underlines the dynamic nature of our data analysis, where hypothesis testing and real world application work hand in hand to steer the company's goal towards its goals. Yes. Um, um, conclusion, recommendation, and next steps for clients. Yeah, uh, the next three steps, the next three slides um, brings together the key findings of our analysis and provides a tailored roadmap for Zizuda Nigeria Limited's future endeavors. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, key findings. Um, in summary, our analysis underscores the pivotal role that modern sewing machine technology can play in propelling Zizuda Nigeria Limited's efficiency and productivity. Um, the potential for revenue growth, elevated customer satisfaction, and um, competitive advan advantage within the industry cannot be underestimated. Um, yeah, um, based on this insight, um, we offer the following recommendations for Zinita Nigeria Limited. Um, we have a phased implementation strategy. We recommend adopting a phased approach to technology implementation begin with um, a pilot program focused on key areas, ensuring seamless integration and um, just addressing any initial challenges before scaling up. Uh, employee empl empowerment, investing in training programs to equip uh, your workforce with the skills needed to effectively operate and manage the new technology. Uh, employee, can, uh, employee empowerment is crucial for the successful integration of modern sewing machines. Um, um, also, strategic ma market expansion. Um, utilize this the insights gained through data analytics to um, identify new market segments and expansion opportunities. Tailor your product offerings to cater to involving customer demands. Yeah. Um, next steps for clients. Yes. Um, we propose the following course of actions. Uh, actually, um, one um, initiate technology and, and assessment. Um, with this, we evaluate the, com the compat um, compatibility of the data analytics through data analytics tools actually with your existing systems. Ensure that the chosen tools align with your business goals and technological infrastructure. Uh, we also have um, employee training and, and, and workshop. Roll out, we roll out comprehensive training programs to familiarize um, employees with the new with the new technology. Workshops and um, hands-on sections with uh, will facilitate a smooth a smooth transition. We also have a data-driven decision making. Um, begin using data analytics to drive decision making process. Monitor key performance indicators closely to measure the impact of the technology can, on efficiency and productivity. Um, we also have um, um, adapt and um, adapt and refine. Yes, adapt and refine. Um, Continuously gather feedback from, from employees and stakeholders. Use, it, use this feedback to adapt and uh, refine your implementation strategy for optimal, optimal results. For optimal results, yes. Um, client feedback, yes. Um, client feedback serves as a private component in the sources of Zinita Nigeria Limited. Zinita Nigeria Limited's endeavor. It embodies um, the voice of those directly impacted by our solutions, offering um, invaluable insight into our strategies, strategies efficiency. Um, engaging in a continuous dialogue with our clients ensures a two-way exchange of information, fostering a collaborative partnership by, um, by actively soliciting and attentively listening, listening to their feedback, we position ourselves to address um, their needs more effectively and tailor our solutions accordingly. Um, this approach may not only enhance customer satisfaction, but also contributes to the refinement of our service. Uh, yes, uh, the next slide um, talks about uh, key lessons learned. Yeah, through the project, I've gained a set of um, vital lessons that have uh, significantly enriched my, my professional insights. Yes, uh, one, we talk about effective communication. Um, quality, quality of communication with all stakeholders ensure a smooth and collaborative um, engagement, leading to the ultimate success of the project. Um, clear communication facilitates shared um, understanding, minimizing um, minimizing, uh, minimizing misunderstandings, actually. Yeah, two, data quality and integration and integrity. Uh, the importance of accurate and reliable data cannot be overestimated, uh, not be overstated. Um, 
Collecting high quality data ensures data integrity, which in turn supports um, robust analysis and, um, and insight decision making. Um, yeah, uh, testing and validation. Um, thoroughly testing the proposed solution of model is essential. Testing on various perspectives that might not have been um, evident in the theoretical phase, um, contributing to a more comprehensive and um, and um, an effective uh, effective solution. Effective solution. Yeah. Um, uh, we also have um, continuous learning. Yeah. Sharing ideas and um, experiences is a, is a is a powerful tool for for uh, for developing effective solutions. Embracing a culture of um, continuous learning and um, data and idea exchange, and idea exchange enhances project efficacy and drives um, drives innovation. Yeah, um, client involvement. Uh, yeah, um, treating the client as a collaborative partner throughout the process fosters joint decision making and ensures that uh, the final solution aligns precisely with the client's needs. Those um, those maximizing their their satisfaction. Um yes, um uh yes, uh, uh personal reflection. Um yes, uh participating in and contributing to the project's um objectives was was truly fulfilling. Uh, the experience of offered ins uh, insight into personal growth, skills enhancement, and uh, valuable knowledge acquisition. Um, engaging in solution development, um, client interaction, and project management bolstered my capabilities. Um, collaborating closely with the Nigeria Limited team allowed tailoring a solution to address the specific needs of the clients. This this active client um, active client um, engagement ensures that um, ensures that our efforts um, align precisely with the with their requirement. Throughout um, the journey. Um, Challenges emerge, um, such as limited data availability and uh, and time constraints. Um, yet, those 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 obstacles uh, those obstacles became opportunities for to refine my problem um, solving solving uh, abilities. The process of uh, overcoming orders served to enhance my my skill set and, uh, and 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 adaptivity. Yeah, uh, thank you and thank you very much.